it's your old buddy Microchip here playing Trains 2019 Platinum Edition. And this is Tidewater Point, episode 36. It's Thomas's turn, and Thomas has to shunt some uh, stuff around. Uh, and to do that, well, first he's got to come over here. Here's the, the track he's got to shunt right here, the cut. It's a big cut. Here it is right here. All this cut all the way down there. Now, where we left off in episode 35 was he was going to do that, except we got a problem over here, which is more incoming trains. Now, this one here is Andrew, and Andrew's got a bunch of cars that he picked up, so he's got to get rid of these. He's got to run to the far end of the yard because these that he has also have to be um, shunted, uh, drilled into the proper tracks, and so he's got to add his cars to that huge cut we already have there and then he's going to run over to the uh, to the uh, engine shed alright you got all that it really doesn't matter if you do or not whoops no let's go to this control here we go we got to get across the level crossing go to the far end of the yard Take these boxcars. I think there's only 12 of them. Well, they're not boxcars. They're actually uh, green hoppers. Oh, I got a cough. All right. Emergency mute cough there for you. It's always fun. I believe this is an SD60. I'll check it. And that looks like an SD40-2. Let's see if I know what I'm talking about. This here is an SD60. Nice. This one here is an SD40-2. I am a professional. Okay, so he's going to shoot these down the the other end. Let's make sure the other end is set up. He's got to come all the way down. Oh, boy. Yeah, he probably shouldn't have picked this track. I forgot this one doesn't have a crossover to it. Well, what difference does it make? So he'll come all the way back here to here and to here. And then he's going to have to bag it on up. After it comes across here to here to here, here. I'm way ahead of the, I'm way ahead of the curve right now. Over to here, over to here, and then inbound, which would be right over here. Yep, and he'll stick them on here. That's what's going on, folks. This track around here is actually not part of the yard. It is a uh, bypass track. Hence, we are bypassing. Hence, we can also probably put a little more speed on there, right? Why not? We're not restricted to 15 miles an hour on this track. It says 40. That's usually when it says when I don't know what the speed limit is. We'll go with it, though. You can see the cars. You haven't got a whole lot of them. Some. But Thomas is going to be busy. He has got one long cut. That we will fit these cars onto this track, no problem. But he's got one long cut to uh, drill. The uh, River Point Yard filled up real quickly. And now the uh, Tidewater Yard is starting to fill up as well. As you would expect. We're on the corner here. And then we'll slow down when we hit the uh, crossover track. Fellas in the uh, tower here. I don't know. Is this south end, north end, east end? I don't know. It's some end. All right, here comes our crossover now. Let's uh, 
Prepare to slow down here just a little bit. That'll do us right there. I set it up right. I did. And I did. Now we're going to run over to this side. And we're going to clear this switch right here. Just a ton of BNSF cars here. Here it comes. like it had already cleared it before it had cleared it you know what i'm saying i was like already showing that there wasn't another train on top of it that's that was weird okay whatever all right now this one should be already set but we'll check it again safety third this way this way this way and then that way okay so here we are now we're back in Back into the yard. We'll be able to see the guys in the tower again. Could be women up there, too. The guys and gals in the tower up there. We got a yeller. Approach. I think 40 will get us right up near 15 mile an hour. 40%. Coke all over my shirt. But it's Coke Zero, so it's not going to leave a sticky residue because there's no only fake sugar in it. Yeah. I'll wipe it up with some tissue. Kind of working. There we go. I guess it's going to be a little bit more than 40%. Let's get to 45 Yeah, that's a 25 mile hour speed limit sign right there. Yeah, we know we passed the signal at danger because uh, it's warning us that there's a train on the tracks up there. Of course, with the way they've, they've been coming in between River Point and, uh, and Tidewater, they snug up right on each other. Why all of a sudden is anybody listening to the signal? My guess is there's maybe there's also hidden signals you can put on the tracks that don't show up in uh, driver. Maybe uh, whoever made this little jointed rail, but whoever had jointed rail made this decided they wanted to have those hidden uh, signals in there. Uh, I don't know. It's always a mystery. We're going to snug these up on these Burlington Northern uh, boxcars. Didn't have a chance to hit an emergency uh, mute there. Tried to, but I missed the button. Down to that.
Beautiful. Okay. Now we're going to go back over onto this end. We're going to decouple. Well, after we hit the uh, handbrake, of course. Decouple. Whoops. And now here we go. Now we're going to roll ourselves on over to the... He's got to pass this one right here. Uh, to the... Uh, I'll say it. Engine shed. Sure, why not? The engine shed. Now that's at a yellow. I think it's for Sean. Because Sean's also going to be cleared out of the way. He's got an approach on this. We got a green. Clear? Clear. Over this right on over this way. Fast clears I'm I'm not used to it. Beautiful. Alright, so we're gonna go this way, then we're gonna go this way. Oh, yeah, yeah. This way. And then what bay are we gonna put him in? We're gonna put him in bay two here. I remember the key oh jeez. <laughs> the key is you gotta click on this and click on that. Yeah. Alright. So now we're going to close door one. Yeah, and we're going to open door two. Here we go. Door two is where we're going. This way. That way. That way. And that way. Ooh, here he comes already. Now, 8008 does not need extensive maintenance on it. It's good. Then the other one is what? Uh, 8732 is the other engine. That one is also got the same requirement. Does not need uh, massive uh, repairs. Just need to get in there, refuel it, wipe all the filth muck off the windows. Maybe get a little Swiffer duster mop on it. You know, that kind of stuff they normally do. Alright, let's not go in here like a bat out of Haiti. Here we go. Here we come, fellas. Make room for us. Everybody squinch in. Whatever that means. All kinds of locals. All my locals are on these two bays over here. All kinds of locals crammed in here right now. Then all kinds of road vehicles. Stop it right there. Kill the bell. Kill the lights. Well, kill the lights. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, now that's one done. Now we got to go back out this way because there's Sean in his SD70 Ace. Don't say on this view. That's an SD80 uh, Max, as a matter of fact. I'm, I'm wrong. Whoop, wrong controls again. Here we go.
Uh, well, okay. We'll go like this. I was going to run up there, but I, I really want to blow the horn while we go across the level cross. <clears throat> it's one of the joys of railroading, really. I don't know if real railroaders feel that way, but I do. Okay, and we, since he doesn't have anything to drop off, we're just going to run him right over the engine shed. Makes sense. Right. All the way down here. Here we go. Doing some bobbing and weaving here. We don't have any of these cuts. Oh, the flag flapping back there at the uh, passenger station is going to say there's Old Faithful, but that's no. The Old Faithful that that isn't at that uh, thing out in Yellowstone uh, shoots water up in the air. Uh, that would be Old Glory that we saw there, not Old Faithful. Of course, we got to decide what bay we're going to put them. I think it's going to be also bay two. Let's take a look, see which one's got the most, either bay one or bay two. I got to look in there. I have not been updating my uh, spreadsheet here. As far as uh, what locals are available. I have Dukes available, but there's more than just Duke in there. No, I just stuck Andrew in there, so what we'll the let's see. Okay. Here just a little bit. Down here just a little bit more. Stop him, and we're gonna go over here and check out where we get where we gonna put him. Yeah, Bay One has got the shorter line. He's not even gonna fit all the way in and on Bay One, is he? No, he is not. So we can close bay door two, open bay door one. We'll just cram them in there as much as we can. Here we go. 20 windows open. Here we come. Now, this is uh, engine 4598. 4598 also does not need extensive repairs. It's going to be immediately available. Like, uh, how far 
up are these guys? I, I parked them there because they were even with the thing, right? That's right. I'll take care of that later. Uh, now we're going to go over here to Thomas. It's finally Thomas' turn to get his get his thing going there, huh? Is he decoupled from this cut? It's not appear as though he is. Thomas, huh? But he's not decoupled. Let's decouple him right now. Let's set the handbrake. There we go. He's going to run it down here. Yep. To pass this switch, switch right up here. And then we'll have him back. Whoops. What did I do? Uh, no way. Cancel. <laughs> oh, that was dangerous. All right. Let's go back to this. Now. Must have hit escape accidentally. There. Cross this level crossing right here. Beautiful. That's where we want to go, all right. Clear this switch right here. There's old glory. That's what I was talking about. Uh, we're going to come down here. We're going to hook on to the first few first part of the uh, inbound cut here. Okay, so everything else is set correctly. It's take them a bit to get, to get here, but look at the detail. The sun glint, the sun, the sun glinting off the tracks. And nice. That's just nice. Bushes are kind of blowing around in the wind a little bit. That's just really, really nice. Alrighty. Pick this up now. And we're going to hook onto this right here. It's bull cars. We're going to the coal dock right here in Tidewater. We just got to drill them onto the correct track. There we go. Kind of weight we pull in here now. Probably quite a bit. We're pulling uh, 3552. Yeah, that's an awful lot for a shunter. All right, so we're pulling all these. We're pulling all of these. Where are we pulling it up to? Uh -huh. All right, figured it out. Uh, yeah, I think we're pulling it all the way up. Yeah, all the way up to this uh, reefer right here. So we're yanking all these cars up to the reefer. Due to the way it's going to take a while. Then after the reefer, we still have quite a few more cars to pull. How many are in the total cut here? 
There's uh, 56 cars in the total cut. He says 58 right there. You got to remember. I don't know. You only got it's 57 cars because there's only one engine. You got to subtract one from the engine. Alrighty. We'll pull this one up to the frog. A nice view of all these storefronts here in Tidewater. Somebody's really nice car. Somebody's not so nice car. Somebody walking down the street. Look at that. Oh, they disappeared. Be Houdini. Mail truck here. A mail truck facility. Okay, stop pointing things out and naming what they are. All right, now we're going to run down here to this frog. That's where we want to line it up. <clears throat> the frog on this track right here. Get out of the way, Bush. Here we go. Okay, so these green here on the end are going into the lower yard. Eight of them are. Let's apply the handbrake. Since they're going on the lower yard, we're going to stick them just on uh, track four. Yeah, sure, track four. That sounds about right. I'll look at. I'll look at just. Go. So we're going to stick it on to yeah, track four. So it goes this way, it goes that way, and then this way. Yeah. So we'll stick them right here right now uh, until we get all the cars lined up here that have to go into the lower yard, which is over here. And we'll take them all down there at the same time. Okay. These are going to bird's eye vegetables, which is why they're going to Tidewater Dock, right? Yeah. Now, wait a minute now. Uh, how many are there's eight of them? Come on, trees, work with me. Uh, here, 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 and this one's going to Tidewater Mills. Uh, the one we're on right there, so that one's not going on to track four. Go backwards now. These Tidewater Mill ones, and then there's eight Tidewater Mill ones uh, that are going to be going on to track three. Which, in case you didn't know, is right next to track four. Yeah, weird how that worked out, isn't it? A little empty field here. You can see me and my brothers using this uh, fence here as a home run fence. Setting up a couple boards for baseball diamonds. Even better here in the corner because you got a fence here and a fence here for home runs. Of course, it goes out in the road or onto the tracks. Dangerous, but eh, we were stupid kids. So. All right, I'm keep my eye on the train way on the other end there. Make sure it's doing it right. It looks like it is. Phyllis is working the tower today, this end of the yard. How's it going, Phyllis? Got air conditioning, see right there, so she's okay. She's happy. There's a switch down here we want to clear. I think it's... This last one here, the third one, yeah, it is. The third one's the one we want to clear.
this box car right here on the right. box car. I mean, the green hopper on the right there. You call them box cars, but no matter how many times you call them, they're not box cars. All right. We'll apply these. Now forward. The, this next eight, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, we're all going on the track three. Go over here. It's a big old. Oh, that was a container or something. It's not. It's like a little shed. Electronics or something? <laughs> Another cough. Uh, yeah, I'm going to back this one out. And connect it up to here, and we'll clear this switch with it. Now, we got plenty of room on this track, right? We have a lot of cars, but it looks like there's plenty of room. Eight more, anyway. Let's get down on it here. Good old yard work. One of my favorite things to do. You don't like yard work. Well, actually, I actually have two choices for you. This may not be the channel for you. Or uh, check one of my other videos. Some other videos, they're not all yard work. But they're mostly yard work. Not all yard work. Some are passenger services. Sometimes we just see a freight train running to get to where it needs to go. Switch here. Here we go. Well, buy that here. Back forward we go. Now the question is: Is the engine going to cross the level crossing before this coal car? Gets past this uh, switch right here. We need to run the bell and the horn or not? Not sure. We'll play it by ear. We may have to. I don't know yet. No. No, 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 no. We won't have to. We won't have to. Oh, yeah, yeah. We got plenty of room here. Okay. Now we're going to back this back onto here. Back up to the front. And we'll go back to the rear. So here, here, here. We're going to push it back again. Much more. Push back. So we've got lots of room left on that track three, though. Coal cars. Beautiful. Roll back these up. I cannot believe we're 35 minutes in. I feel like I'm going to play for 10 minutes. Okay.
There we go. All right, so now i got to figure out what the next part of the cut's going to be, so I'm going to put you guys, or where it's got to go anyway. Uh, I'm going to put you guys on uh, pause until I figure that out. Somebody's got to get down here and clean this out. Looks like it's full of filth muck. The slats are uh, open, <clears throat> but the fan is not turning. Um, but the uh, thoughts of my brain are turning, if I can get this to go. There we go. Because uh, I now know where the next part of the cut's going to go. Okay, here we are, here. Let's uh, apply. Uncouple. And let's go forward. Grab on to the next cut. This next cut's got to be a lot shorter than that first one was. Not as many cars. Of course, I'm not sure how it could have... Well, no, I guess it could be longer. It could be shorter to have more cars if the cars are really short, but... Basically, the cars are pretty close to the same length. Another emergency mute for coughing. Sure wish I get rid of this cough. Just can't seem to do it. Don't feel sick. Just got a cough. Okay, here we go. Back onto this reefer here. Beautiful. Oh, did you see that? It was like a double clutch. He started, but then the slack pulled him backwards a little bit there. All right, and then we have... So we're pulling this um, reefer. That's going on to track four because it's going to go on the lower track. These diesels have to go on the lower track. And these are going to Tidewater Mills, these green hoppers. We're only the first four in this cut. Uh, and that's where we're going to stop it after we get the fourth one through here. So there's number one. There's number two. Here's the third one. Here's the fourth one. That's the last one we're pulling right there. Slow it down. Slow it down. Keep my cursor on it. Beautiful. Stop it right there. Apply the handbrake. Decouple. Let's go forward. Oh, he's already crossed. <laughs> I was going to blow the horn and all that, but a lot closer than I thought it was. All right. Whoops. Hit the mic. Don't hit the mic. Go clear that. And we're sticking these on to track three again. Very good. It should already be aligned with track three, right? Uh, should be, but it's not. Oh, no, because we put the coal back. Okay, let's go on to the back here. Here we go. Looks like these first four are all going to go on to track three, and then the other uh, four, the one Reaper and the three diesels, are going to go on to track four because they got to go to the lower yard down over there. Be over here to the left. Hold that down a little bit. Clear this switch right here once again.
go. And we'll snap it right there. Long, long stop. There we go. Now we'll pull it forward. Right, we're not going to hit that again. All right, no. We're not. And we're going to put the rest of them here on track four. her up. Nice. Alrighty. Get up here. Yeah, I've had people uh, ask me several times, and I think I mentioned this before, but why don't I kick cars? I could kick cars. I prefer not to, though. I don't know why. I just prefer to drill them this way. I don't, I don't want to kick them. If you want to see freewheeling cars, just watch my UMR uh, series. I do quite a bit of humping. Well, in comparison to any other video where I do no humping, it's quite a, quite a bit. Uh, and then you can see cars rolling along, freewheeling all you like. All right. Move these back as they are destined for the lower yard. Here we go. Stop it right there. Beautiful. All right, put you guys on pause. I figure out where the next uh, part of this cut's got to go. We're taking a lunch break here in the scrap yard, sitting on some scrap metal. Plus, we get to watch uh, Danny over here, so it's nice to sit down here and watch Danny. He's sweeping up stuff over there. Danny, there he goes. Look at him. He's walking and sweeping, sweeping and walking. Then there's Harold over here. Just likes to pound holes in things. What are you pounding holes in over here, Harold? He doesn't know. He's looking around to see if anyone's noticing. He goes back to pounding holes. Okay, so uh, I figured it out. I figured out the last part here. Let's get it done. We're going to pull the whole entire rest of the cut. Trying to suppress coughs. All right. We got grain and goods. That's all we got left on this uh, inbound track now. Grain hoppers and goods cars. Otherwise known as box cars. down to there like that how come I can't why isn't the switch coming up no it's being a jerk back it up here now <coughs> oh actually we made a little bit on that level crossing didn't we ah what do you get no one was there gates are always down anyway Down to this right here. Let's get some. Little double clutch there. All right. This first set of green cars are all going on to track three. They're all headed for Tidewater Mills. And we got goods cars that are going off map. That's going to be the lower yard. That's track four. Then there's some more grain cars. There's one grain car here that's going on track one because it's going uh, on a local in the area. 
then the other ones are going on to track three as they are also locals. Yes. Oh, no, the, the ones that are going on track one, the 11 goods are going on track one, are, are supposed to go to uh, River Point. That's right. They just came here from River Point, but then they got reclassified when they got here, so now we're going to send them back. Not very efficient, and I didn't blow the horn or do the bell. Now, there's nobody else going to give us a problem here, is there? No, there's nobody else here. So first we're going to track three, the very last green car. Coming here sometime. Slow it down a little bit. And in a little bit more. Back around up to track three. Uh, wait, wait, let's check out. Yes, yeah, so this one all the way down this end is going to Grayson Farms, which is track three. The ones four that are going to Purdue Grains, which is back in River Point. Get the next 11. Track three is correct. Track two. Here's track three. Let's ride this one in. Where you at? Where'd you go? There you are. Scare me like that. It's never good when you lose a train. Back under the gantry. Shave our heads a little bit on the uh, roof line there. Beautiful. Nice and gentle like. Here we go. Let's go forward one now. The slack to play out here a little bit. Okay, a little bit more. I'm tired of waiting. Handbrake. There we go. Now we're off to track. One. Track one is River Point. We're all going to Purdue Grains. Track one, where are you at? I think this is track one here with the uh, TUFCs on. That would make sense. There is a TUFC intermodal station there. We have room on track one? We do. Back down over here. Flying around like Superman. Or Spider-Man if you prefer, you know, Marvel over DC. Go. 
right there. Let's back these 11 uh, green hoppers onto track three. Yeah. How about we put them on track one? Sure. That sounds like a good idea. Let's put them on track one where we said we were going to put them. We got two more stops to make. Track four for the goods, uh, uh, for the box cars, and then uh, track three for the green. Beautiful. Like it when a plan comes together. To uh, quote B.A. Baracus, is that what his name was? Guy in charge of the A team. It was, or, or that was Mr. T, wasn't it? B.A. Baracus, wasn't that Mr. T? Who am I thinking of? The guy with the cigar. What the heck was his name? I don't know. Alrighty. So let's back these on there. Still can't see Thomas around the corner way up there. See a whole lot of Burlington Northern, though. A lot of dandelions, too. Look at some here. So you look at these over here. I've got to get out here with some weed control. Too many dandelions. Alrighty, there we go there. Sound is cutting in and out on those trucks. That's okay. There we go. I don't know how to improve that. I just kind of live with it. We'll apply that right there. Take it forward again. Like I said, these uh, goods are going on to track four because I got to go out of the lower yard. Where are they going? They're going, uh, no, not Peninsula Co-op. Oh, River Point out. That's right. They are leaving the map, is what they're doing. They're destined to leave the map by going through River Point. The exit, that's on the other side of River Point. Goodness knows we have enough... Uh, we have enough uh, road train sitting in the engine shop over there. We can spare one to take this one out. Pretty much. Take it off the map. Never see it again. Right. Grab onto the Berlin Northern. Let's get down a little bit lower this time. And then sit on this side. 217118. Track four coming up. Slow down a little bit late on that one. Still going to hit it at the right speed. Over this sign. We got a lot to, when he's done doing this up here, his turn's still not going to be over. He's got to run these all down to the uh, lower yard. That's why we hired you, Thomas, because you are a killer. You are a work animal. You know, beautiful. Wait, wait. Oh, 
compliant. Okay, in his last set, here we're going to the Peninsula Co-op, which is a... Uh, I think that's, that's the one that's right next to Tidewater Mills. The big grain facility, Tidewater Mills. And these are going on to track three, which is uh, track right here. I think this time we may cross the uh, level crossing. I think so. We'll play it safe. We're not going to cross. When I do cross, I forget to do it. And then I always remember to do it. When it turns out, it's not necessary that I do do it. Back these in here now. Right through the phone wires. this up then he's got a hook up to the lower yard there lower yard cut head on down this track which leads to the lower yard it all makes sense sort of. here we go Right there. So, once he unhooks from this, we got to take all of this down to the lower yard. And this track here is filling up. Very good. But I'm looking over at the time, and we're in the butter zone. Like Land the Lakes butter. Okay. Uh, before we go into the, before we take off, though, you can see here, here's a, 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 a an overview of the entire area. You see, here's our engine shop with all of our trains in it. Here's the lower yard here. Here's the upper yard. Here's Thomas and his cut that he just uh, pushed back that way. So you get an overall view here of what's going on. Here's the dock area over here. Harley Brothers, crude dock, ethanol, all that good stuff. Look at that. Little map, little map action here at the end. Okay, so, uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching uh, episode 36 of Tidewater Point. Hope you had fun. Uh, you should uh, come back sometime and watch episode 37 whenever I get that up there. Uh, here I have this down as episode 4. What? Okay, on my spreadsheet, it's totally wrong. But anyway, uh, so uh, why don't you leave me a, a like? Why don't you leave me a uh, comment? Why don't you subscribe? I really appreciate it. And if you don't like maps like I just showed you just before we left here, well, this just may not be the channel for you.